What is up ladies and gentlemen and welcome. In this video we're going to be going over some of the stuff that I bought at Collecticon. I made a few purchases. I bought a couple of blind bags and we do have this little booster card thing. I think there's only one card in here. I caught this. They were throwing them away to the audience. Also caught this bracelet here. Uh, Collecticon. It was my first time there and I had a lot of fun. They had a lot of uh, voice actors there to meet. I did get to meet uh, the voice of Aaron Yeager, Bryce Pamperbrook. I know I'm not saying that right, but yeah, the voice actor Aaron got to take a picture of him. Also got his autograph in this nice poster. I just bought a uh, top loader. Usually they sell top loaders at this types of events um let's put this down um but i couldn't find any in this event for some reason maybe i missed them so i just ordered one of amazon but he was a really great person really cool guy and uh we just love meeting him i also wanted to meet uh, uh sean shamo the voice of goku in dragon ball super his line was just way too long i couldn't get in um they capped off the line like after a certain point and um, I actually waited about five hours 45 hours just to meet the voice actor of Aaron Yeager but I mean he was a really nice guy and I had to meet him I met the voice actress of uh, Mikasa Trina and at uh, C2E2 earlier this year so I had to meet Aaron get both their autographs but anyways um, First of all, I want to show you some of the blind bags that I bought that we are going to be opening today. First one here is a Yu-Gi-Oh! Um, keychain blind bag. This is the biggest one I have. In the back you see all the ones that you can possibly get. Um, hangers. That's what they're called, hangers right there. They all look like uh, they're all, they're all good choices. I mean, so you can't really go wrong with this, whoever you get. So that's why I got it. The second blind bag we have a uh, Avatar, the last Airbender. And bag we have the choices, the possible, and you do have some exclusive ones that we don't know even though some of you might know by the outline of those figures i'm not really sure who these might be all right the third one we have another Yu-Gi-Oh blind bag these are a little smaller than the first one and again we also have a exclusive there so I got some of like um some of my best like animes that I like that's why I chose these blind bags in no particular order I wash them of course we have to get an attack at Titan blind bag Let's just focus come on focus there we go really hope for I'm not even sure I don't like any of these honestly but I really want a Mikasa out of this one we'll see and the last blind bag we have Dragon Ball Super And of course, we're going to be opening the booster pack. And I want to show you guys. Uh, so I got did get two plushies there. They're not the licensed ones, but they were kind of cheap. They were like $12 each. The first one we have here is Mewtwo. Look at this little guy. It's probably like a six, six inch plush, I would say.
and my second one, the little fat boy. We got a fat Lugia. Not that there's anything wrong with it. It does have a little belly, but it's so cute. Lugia being one of my favorite Pokemons. All right, so anyways, oh wait, they got one more thing. I got a wallet and this is like, a, I don't know if you guys have seen them, a ridge, it's kind of like a ridge wallet. Those little mini wallets that you, um, really small, tiny wallets that you can put your cards in. It has a money clip to put your cash on there. And this is why I got it. We got Vegeta. And yeah, this is how it works. Just stick your cards in there. It's supposed to be a minimalist wallet. I don't know, you guys can't really see that. I know it's like too dark. You push, your cards will be in the bottom. You push them up and it's stick out um, whichever card you may need. I know these do get scratched though, so I don't know how long that's gonna last, but it's a pretty good wallet. All right, now let's get to the fun part. We're gonna start with the booster. Also, and the Collecticon with this, have a concert, sort of a mini concert for uh, Jason Page, who is the original singer of the Pokemon theme song, the original Pokemon theme song, theme song. So I got to hear that live, which was awesome. All right, here we go. Oh, how, should I, how should I do this? I just do this. Focus. Who is this? I can't even see that from here. They're in Japanese. So I'm not even going to be able to like read off their names because I'm not really familiar with the newer ones. But let's just take a look. I know this one. Larvitar. Then we have a zigzag Sagoon. Oh, we got a little hollow PG Auto. No, this one too. Look at that. It looks pretty cool. I like the animation on it. Not animation, I mean the drawing. And we have, what is this? Charmeleon. All right. And not a bad pool, I say. And the bags are also a little different from when I used to collect them. I know it's just because of this booster. But I caught these from the Pokemon performance. Right before he uh, Jason Page started performing, they started throwing out boosters. Um, let's start the blind bag opening with the avatar. This is series two. And I can kind of see it. And I was kind of hoping for a, who is this? <laughs> the cabbage guy. I was not hoping for the cabbage guy. <laughs> I was hoping for a Toph. Kind of tricked me there. Cause I saw a little bit of green. I thought we were getting Toph, but cabbage guy, I'll take him. My cabbages. I'll save this. Microphone probably love this one. Uh, all right, next one. We're gonna save the big one for last, just because I don't think you can go wrong when any of the flying bags. Next one. Let's do the Yu-Gi-Oh one. This one. Let's see. We got Exodia, Blue Eyes, Yugi. Dark Magician, Karibo. Karibo would be nice. I wouldn't be upset if I get a Karibo. But let's see what we got.
Ready? We got the red eyes. I think that's what it is, right? The red eyes black dragon. Yeah. Not bad. I'll take it. Good pull. All right, we've got two down, three more to go. Got Dragon Ball, Attack on Titan. Let's do Attack on Titan. And this is a weekend pool. Alright, here. I see blonde hair at the top already. And what is this? This is, um, damn, what's his name? No, wait, who is this? Is this Armin? Reiner? No, this is not Reiner. I got one of the exclusive. No, I'm not sure who this is. I don't think it's Armin. Um, could it be one of the kids? And uh, it is the final season, but I can't really think of any of them. I don't know. I think it might be one of the kids and um, with the other Titans. I just can't remember their name right now. If you guys know, just type it in the comments. Uh, all right. Let's move on to the next one. Next one, we have the Dragon Ball Super. This one, we have, see some feet at the bottom. Gohan? <laughs> yeah, we got Gohan, Nerd Gohan. Not bad. I knew this one. And we are now into the last bag. Here are what we might be able to get. Like I said, you can't go wrong with any of these. Okay. We have another Red eyes, black dragon. I don't know if you guys can see. There we go. This is a very detailed figure. I don't know if you guys can see the teeth right there. The tail. Yeah. Pretty cool. The clip right here, we got the Millennium Puzzle. All right guys, but that's it for my items of the Collecticon. Pretty good blind bags, I'd say. This one's gonna kill me because I know I'm gonna remember the name of him later and I'm gonna like kick myself for it but yeah this is stuff we got and not to mention the Aaron poster my fat boy can't wait to start using that wallet too anyways guys hope you guys enjoyed this video I'll probably have some highlights of the Collecticon in another video possibly but anyways, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I'll see you guys next time.